then you also get to be part of our amazing community. Inside of that, you guys, we are doing a 90-day legacy run right now. I am walking you through how to make 10K a month over the next 90 days. So 30K in 90 days. Put in the comments how your life would change if you made 30K in the next 90 days. Please let me know in the comments what that would do for your life. Because you guys realize if you can make 30K in the next 90 days, you can continue to do that over and over. Yes, freedom. I love that word. And so this is what you get inside the community. Now, people that are part of our Legacy Builder program, this is what they're saying. They were able to discover their perfect customer. They were able to get the best coaching, valuable coaching they've ever had, um, discover their perfect customer. Um, they love the breakout rooms, right? This is what's happening inside the program. So what I want to do next is I want to have uh, Cecilia come on and share you guys because I love her story, how when she started plugging into the perfect training, uh, the perfect customer training, what it did for her business. So Cecilia, I'm going to let you take it away. Hi, everybody. I hope you are all well. So I'm Cecilia Jacobs, all the way from South Africa as well. And when I got started in this, I was a overworked, very overworked mom. I worked 15 hours a day in my own salon. And most of that studies that I do did to do the, the salon was online. And before that, I had ECD. I studied online. So when I came across this and I realized I could learn how to make an income, learning the skills online, it just absolutely made sense to me. So... I started in May, actually 21 days from now, I will only be in doing this for a year. So I started back in May, 2023, and my very first six weeks, I didn't make anything, right? But when I hit my first, when I made my first sale after six weeks, it was still for me like a very short time. I did see, however, you know what, these people coming in and within a day, two days, five days, they were starting to make money. So I was like, because I came from MLM, I mean, I also tried many things before. And because I came from MLM, I thought, I've got this. I've got this. I know it all. So I skipped some training, right? So by week six, I decided, no, I'm definitely doing something wrong. So let me go right back into that training and see what it is that I'm missing. And I came across how to discover your perfect customer, which Michelle was speaking about now. And I went through that training. And I kid you not, like literally the very next morning, I woke up to my first sale. So if if there's one thing I can tell people, it doesn't ma matter whether you sell gold online. If you do not know how to connect or how to discover who your clients is, my friend, nobody ain't going to buy your gold, right? So I literally the next morning, I woke up to my first sale. Two hours later, another sale. The next morning, $600. And that put me way into profit mode. And I did that working two hours a day. I had to fit that into the nooks and crannies of my day because I was working 15 hours a day. I was missing out on everything with my daughter. Sometimes it would be breakfast, lunch, and even dinner that I couldn't have with her, that I was sitting and working. And I, I was like, literally, and I mean, like I said, now it's 11 and a half months. In 21 days, it would be a year. So within three months, six weeks, before I started, four weeks after my very first commission that I decided, let me do the training that I'm supposed to be doing. Four weeks after that, I had my very first South African six-figure month, which was 145,000 South African rand. So for me, that turned me immediately into a six-figure earner. And also my very first time, I've never had six figures in my bank account that was like, this is yours, do whatever you want, right? So it just kept on escalating. I mean, every single sprint that I've taken on that's inside like the 90, uh, 30K, 90 days that Michelle showed you now, every single sprint that I've taken on, I've been able to make 10K and more. I mean, last month was a $15,800 month. That's like 293 thousand rand in South Africa. The month before that was over 12,000. That's another 228,000 South African rands. I cannot remember the last time I didn't have a six-figure month as a South African. This has changed my life. Within three months, I was out of debt. Month four, I replaced my prayer car with a safe car to drive my daughter in. Month five, I flipped my zip code. I moved from a small town called Messina, 
right up to Jeffrey's Bay. And I didn't just flip my zip code. I had a dream. I had a vision. I always said, what if every time that I took that short, um, over-budgeted holiday where you have to like really, really plan out every penny. So I always had this vision. What if life could be like this? What if I could walk on the beach at any time with my child? What if from the morning that I wake up until the evening that I go to bed, I could like literally whenever she needs me, be there. So when I flipped my zip code, I literally flipped it into my dream life. I flipped it to beach view. I flipped it to walking on the beach with my daughter. I flipped it to when I pick her up from school, I get to spend the rest of my time with her. I flipped it to being a present mom. So if you've been doubting about this and you've been wondering, you know, all these South Africans telling you, especially the South Africans tonight, been telling you that they've been making this, I want to tell you within seven months of starting this, I became my family's first millionaire. My friend, I'm 21 days away from, um, from being in on this a year and I've made over 2.3 million South African rands. So if I could do this, anybody can do this i'm telling you anybody i didn't know old from enter i didn't know how to set up tiktok i didn't know how to i had to ask my team the first time how do i make a video and this is what life has become so if i can do this you sure can do this so awesome so i have a question to ask you what because you're almost at a year right so what do you feel has been the most rewarding part as a mom and being able to do this the security that I can offer my child as a single mom, the um, the time. Michelle, I cannot, I cannot explain the restoration in the relationship between me and my teenager. I mean, people, I haven't realized how much we have outgrown each other in the time when I was working 15 hours a day. It was like we literally got to know each other again when I started working two hours only. But... Just that knowing that, you know, as a single mom, I have got security for my daughter and definitely the example that I'm setting because I'm showing her you don't need to work like that in order to enjoy life. Awesome. It's just, it's just amazing. It's just awesome. And I love how easy this was. I mean, I know a lot of people will probably say something like, but it, it can't be easy. And I mean, me not being techie, this is so step by step, so step by step. Yes. Oh, love that so much. I had to share because I love, I wanted you to share that because, you know, as a mom, we, uh, you know, it's always about the time with our children, right? Absolutely. So, yes. So you guys, I'm going to share with you and actually I redid the math on this, but in 30 days, our legacy builder program has sold $3.4 million. And actually I did the update number here before I got on here and um, for 32 days, we're now at $3,693,000 a Legacy Builder program has, has made, right? And that is 100% profit into our community's pockets. So that means the community members have, have made $3.6 million in 32 days just off this Legacy Builder program. And you guys look at this, Ashley, she's made 150,000 in 123 days by following this program, okay? Step by step. Now, a lot of people are going, I don't understand. How are they making money like this? Because the world is going digital. You guys, let me let me just stop here a minute. Because the world is going digital. That's something you can't deny. No matter what you decide to, if you want to make money, everything is based on some type, type of product or service, right? Doctors don't make money unless they have patients. That's a buyer, right? Hotels don't make money unless they have people stay at the hotel. Um, Verizon doesn't make money unless they sell this cell phone. Do you realize if you um, buy, have a cell phone, you bought that from T-Mobile or AT&T or Verizon, right? But that's not Verizon's cell phone. Apple had a vision one day of creating a phone. And Apple allowed other companies to be able to sell a done-for-them, ready-to-go product because Verizon didn't want to take the time to learn how to do this. 
right? And so now Verizon can sell somebody else's product and they can resell this over and over again because if I sell this to Amy and a month later, Amy decides she doesn't want it because she wants to get the new iPhone, she can return it back to me. I can refurbish it and I can sell it again to Matha. It can be sold over and over again. So where a lot of people have a hard time wrapping around, you're so used to physical products. Well, now we have the digital world. Example, I bought this marker at um, Office Depot. You realize Office Depot didn't make this marker. Office Depot bought this marker and are able to resell these markers. It's called business, you guys. But in today's world, when you have a digital product that you can sell, you make 100% profit because there's not all the overhead like you do in other products, right? So no matter what you decide to do today, when you want to make money, you got to be selling some type of product or program or service. Now, if you're selling a service, you're trading time for dollars, right? Now, let's talk about the digital world. The digital goods economy is an, a, a gigantic $950 billion market. The e-learning industry did $950 million in 2019. It averages $1.2 billion a day in 2024, you guys, it's projected to hit 3 billion a day by 2027. 